How's it going, guys? We're going to go ahead and review WebRoot Secure Anywhere Internet Security Complete. Sounds like a big name, huh? That's because it's their top of the line product. This is the one for 2015. And I'm sorry about my mic being uh, low quality right now. Something happened to my mic. And I just ordered a new one. And until it gets in, I'm going to have to use this one. So, again, sorry for the low quality on the mic. But. Here we are at PC Magazine, and let's see what they had to say about WebRoot Secure Anywhere Internet Security Complete 2015. They give, they give it an editor rating of excellent, and the pros on it, in their point of view, is that it's extremely small and light on resources, which is true. That's what I like about it. Fast install and scan. Top marks from two independent lab tests and PC Mag tests, so according to the tests done by PC Mag, it does pretty good very good malicious URL blocking full feature password manager mobile support remote management PC optimization and online backup and sync the cons is that it requires internet connectivity for full protection no anti-spam or parental control supposedly it's the security complete but it doesn't come with no parental control or spam protection what's wrong with that competitors offer more for they offer more advanced PC optimization and backup system. The backup system here on WebRoot lacks uh, secure file sharing. The bottom line is a secure web WebRoot secure anywhere. Internet security complete adds backup and PC optimization to the features of WebRoot's entry level suite. It's amazingly tiny, but it does not, but it doesn't do as much as competing mega suites. All right. Here it is right here, I already downloaded the trial. If you want to download the trial, you can go to this website here. I will post a link on the description of the video for the article in PC Magazine and for the download. You just got to fill out, fill up your first, last name, email, and you can get the trial that way. All right, and here it is. Once you install it, this is what it looks like. Now, right off the bat, it's telling me I have threats. Let's go ahead and click on Scan My Computer. And there it goes. I don't know if this is a full or quick scan. I think it might be a quick. It's going by pretty fast. Pretty fast. I'll get back with you guys once the scan is finished. All right, guys, the scan is finished, and it found three th threats. Now, I'm going to have to look into them because uh, these might be what's called false positives. I typically, I typically try to keep my computer virus-free. All right, but sometimes we'll, a couple of them slip through. But false positives are good programs that you trust, that you like. But the antivirus program looks at it as a virus. So uh, I'm going to click on clean up later. But if you do find viruses, you just click on continue, and it'll take you to the steps of removing them. All right, now let's take a look here. Let's take a look at the rest of the features here in WebRoot Secure Anywhere. Under PC security, you could uh, here you can turn off or on the real-time shields, web shields, or firewall. It does have an identity protection feature to it. Right now, it's on. Phishing shield is on. Backup and sync. You can go ahead and uh, let's click on start now. You have to make an account with them, which I haven't done yet. But once you make an account, you can go ahead and back up your files. And what that means is you can go to, to another computer somewhere else that has WebRoot or install WebRoot on another computer and you can get your back backup files back on that computer. Or if your computer was to tank from a virus, you can always get your files back that way using this feature. Password Manager. Click on Start Now and let's take a look at it. I think we might have to buy it actually. You have to create an account to get in. I'm just going to go ahead and log in. I have a... I actually do have an account with them. And see if it works. I had to use it to download. Uh, when you when you download the free trial, you'll make an account. Did not work. Okay. To use the password manager, you guys got to sign up, and it should come with the program. And basically, what it does is you can keep the passwords in uh, in their in their database. Basically, you can keep a list of passwords, so that way, you know, if you forget a password, you can always go back and look at it there and it's a secure place. All right. Let's take a look at the utilities that come with this program. 
it comes with a system optimizer and let's go ahead and test it out looks like it's in progress system optimizer it's doing files registry entries it's cleaning up space on my computer really nice all right once it's done optimizing it'll take you back to this screen I don't know why it took me back to this screen but let's click on reports and here we should see what has happened view history there it is okay that's a lot of history to look through <laughs> but the optimization did go through but it's weird it didn't give me any report or nothing all it did was take me back to this screen here that was odd okay now let's go ahead and take a look at the system control function here run system analyzer let's see what that does so this program has a couple of features but I'm not really impressed with uh, the features that it has I, I, I expected more from the uh, complete version but right now it's just searching it's analyzing hardware and stuff I think it's gonna try to give me a report of all the info on the computer all right it's done now and it uh, looks like under hardware some devices are not functioning and may need to be installed less than 30 percent of your hard disk and space is free <laughs> that's very true my hard drive is about to run out I need to get a better better hard drive. System is running without frequent crashes. So that's good. Updates are available. I turn off automatic updates because they bug. I, I don't recommend that with you guys. You got to know what you're doing. But I turned it off. Active process has possible memory leak. Chrome.exe. Chrome has always been known to take a lot of memory from your computer. So if you're running Chrome, make sure you have a lot of RAM. Private information may be stored. There are three active infections on your computer, which is those three that it that it uh, found a while ago, but they're false positives. Windows Automatic Update is disabled, of course. That's why I want it. And the phishing filter Internet Explorer is disabled. So it, by running this, you can see what's going on in your computer, which is really cool. So let's look at the rest of it here. And that's it. That's actually all the utilities. That's it. I'm not that impressed with this uh, Secure Anywhere web root. I gotta give this uh, program a low review because I'm not really that impressed. I mean, it has the utilities to optimize your computer and it does it all automatically. And it doesn't even give you a freaking report. So it feels like it didn't do anything. It scanned, it took a while, but um, it did find some stuff, but there were false positives. I, I don't really have a virus in my computer, I think. But uh, those false positives, I'm not really that impressed. Alright guys, thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. I'm always uploading new videos on new software like this coming out. And let me know what you think about this program. If you have it, you've tried it, go ahead and comment in the comment section of the video. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.